Today we are going to show how to photograph a car as part of a crash investigation. Our photographer is coming in and first thing he's doing is taking pictures of the vehicle identification number. Vehicle identification number is located uh, on the driver's side through the windshield and also on several other locations around the car. Notice that the photographer next is drawing an imaginary circle around the car. Think of the imaginary circle as a clock. We started at the 12 o'clock position move to the 11 o'clock, move to the 10 o'clock, and so forth, until he's completely surrounded the, surrounded the car. One of the things that you'll run into oftentimes is the car will be jammed in a tight area in which you need to uh, widen the lens. So for example, if you have a 50 millimeter lens, you may have to change to a 30 millimeter lens in order to get a, a full view of the car. If that's not possible, do the best you can. After you complete the circle, you then go in and take more detailed photographs of the specific damaged area.